Rudy Gay with the three. And you see his uh, reaction and a fan heckling him. And, and supposedly this fan is a well-known local rapper. Wall A, he's not Drake, that's for sure. Wale took offense to Matt Devlin's assessment of his rap career during a 2013 game, even confronting the Raptors broadcaster. Eventually, they were able to put their differences aside. A fixture in the NBA Celebrity All-Star Game, actor Kevin Hart let his emotions get away in 2012. After taking exception to a foul call, Hart lets the officials have it, picking up a pair of technicals. Despite the ejection, Hart was still awarded game MVP. Mark Cuban has been fined nearly $2 million for his criticism of officials since taking ownership of the Mavericks in 2000. However, his most infamous run-in was the mere prank. I have a hunch, guys, that this might be an <laughs> April Fool's kind of guy. Dell Harris was not aware of it. Look at Dell. <laughs> <laughs> Dell didn't get the memo. Dell was <laughs> reeled in on that one. New York Jets center Nick Mangold aggressively heckled the Penguins bench during a playoff game last season at Madison Square Garden. It wasn't enough to get under Sidney Crosby's skin, though. He's got his ticket. He can do what he wants. I, I think that it's, you know, it's not typically what you see, but at the same time, I, I don't have a problem with it. Crosby did have one athlete in his corner. His Pirates all-star Garrett Cole had words for Washington's bench later in last season's playoffs. The 2015 All-Star cooled off after a warning from security. Jack Nicholson's known for his courtside seats at Laker games, but sometimes he gets a little too close. Jack Nicholson apparently got involved with one of the officials. I thought Jack is a great actor, and he did a wonderful job of acting to energize the crowd, And to, but he was very sincere about it. I thought he did a good job of acting on that. He got an Oscar from me for that. LeBron James could have fooled some into thinking he was a lifelong Indians fan during this year's World Series. That wasn't the case during the 2007 ALCS in Cleveland. Now, I've always been a Yankee fan. I'm a big Derek Jeter fan, man. and uh, I'm here to uh, represent for the Yankees, but right now it's not looking too good. Jimmy Buffett enjoys sitting courtside at NBA games, but back in 2001, he was ejected for yelling profanities at referees. He is getting up, you'll see him in the yellow shirt now, and he is being escorted out of American Airlines Arena for mouthing off to the officials. They're throwing Jimmy Buffett out? That's unbelievable. Drake right there. Drake takes all of his job very seriously. Time to help the cause. And a five second. Successfully helped his squad by actually saying something to Justin Holiday and causing a, or forcing a five second violation as he tried to inbound the ball. <laughs> no celebrity in the crowd impacted the game more than Spike Lee, who had legendary battles with Reggie Miller. Every time he had a shot, he was staring in my direction. I think after his fifth three, his fifth three pointer, he, he, that's when he, he held a fourth finger, which meant the fourth chord, and put both his hands around his neck. Right. With choke. Sometimes he opens his mouth a little bit too much and gets the other guys going. I think tonight was one of those nights.